The quarter inch quilting foot is essential for any quilter to ensure accurate quarter inch seams when sewing patchwork, but it also has other uses even if you don't quilt. Quarter inch feet come in two basic styles, with a guide and without a guide. They may also be found in metal or clear plastic. Ultimately, all will do the same job, give you a quarter inch seam, but each has its merits. The quarter inch foot with a guide along the edge prevents your quarter inch seams from growing too wide, which is easy to do, and after multiple too wide or too narrow seams, your quilt blocks will not fit together properly. Some people prefer the foot without the guide because sometimes when piecing, the guide can push protruding triangle tips out of alignment, and the foot without the guide also works best when top stitching within the fabric. Just like a mechanic has several Phillips head screwdrivers, each one being better in certain situations, a quilter needs to have a couple of types of quarter inch feet. Use them as you find appropriate in your sewing situations. Any one of them will be the right choice to begin with. Though each foot appears different, let's look at the commonalities between the feet. From the center needle position to either the right edge of the foot or sometimes the outer toe of the foot is one quarter inch. Some feet also have an eighth inch marking on the foot for sewing tiny eighth inch seams for doll clothes or top stitching. Many feet also have quarter inch and eighth inch horizontal markings in front of and behind the needle hole. These lines are used when pivoting corners and top stitching and when sewing some quilt blocks where stitching must start and stop one quarter inch from the edge and not at the edge itself. To turn a corner, sew slowly up to the corner and if necessary use the hand wheel to take a stitch and position the corner seam exactly in line with the horizontal markings. Leave the needle down and turn the fabric and continue sewing. The quarter inch foot is helpful for other types of sewing too. Use it for sewing quarter inch garment seams that some pattern companies use. If you are top stitching a lapel or other edge, the quarter inch foot gives you a consistent professional finish to your work. Decorative work is also possible with a quarter inch foot. Using the triple straight stitch and a decorative thread, this blouse cuff was quickly embellished for a designer look. For those that have shied away from the time consuming work of the classic French seam, try this updated variation. The seam is slightly wider than the traditional French seam, but it eliminates the step of trimming the seam. Position the fabric's wrong sides together and sew a quarter inch seam. Press the seam open and then fold right sides together and press. Finish the seam with a 3 8 inch seam allowance. A neatly finished seam that takes your sewing to a couture level with a minimum of work. The colorful world of sewing.com has quarter inch feet for all brands of sewing machines. Even if you already have a quarter inch foot, stop by and take a look at the others available to see if one might better suit your needs. The quarter inch quilting foot brings accuracy to all your narrow seaming tasks.